Are you struggling to manage your leads across Lemlist and HubSpot? There is a way for you to automatically connect to your HubSpot lead list so that every single lead that appears in your CRM in HubSpot is linked automatically to Lemlist and you don't have to manually import anything. As well as that, all the activity like email opens, replies, and notes that you make within Lemlist are synchronized back to your CRM. Let's have a look at how you can do that. So first things first, we've got to connect Lemlist to HubSpot. So to do that, you come up here, you click in settings, you come along to integrations, and then here, if you scroll down, you have HubSpot Connect. Now, all you need to do is very simply connect your HubSpot account by clicking here and you'll be asked to log in. And there you go, just like that, you're connected. Now, once you're within HubSpot, what you can do is you can create a lead list. So if you come down here and you go to lists, you can create any kind of list that you want. It could be by persona, it could be by location, it could be by whatever it is that you like. I use an example here of sales. So whatever you call this, this is what you'll have to search for within Lemlist in order to connect it. And that will make sense in just a second. So this one here is called inbound tail sales. Let's go back to Lemlist and go over to a campaign, create a new campaign, we'll call it HubSpot import. You go along to lead list, you click import new leads and you choose CRM. HubSpot is the one that you click on, which is available now that we've connected. Continue with HubSpot. The HubSpot account will be mine. And then here is where I'm going to search for that particular lead list that we looked at a second ago. So I type in tal, inbound tal sales. I can already see it. And there you go. And what this is going to do is it's going to pull all of the leads from HubSpot into this Lemlist campaign ready to prospect. Now, what we have the option here to do is automatically pause a lead in Lemlist when they no longer match a HubSpot filter. So for example, if they suddenly are not considered sales in HubSpot, it will remove them from that particular lead list and it will remove them also from the Lemlist campaign. So it basically means that you're not going to prospect anyone that doesn't fall into this particular category. You don't get modeled up, keeps it nice and clean. So we can click that one, then we click continue. And here, what we can do is we can automatically verify any existing emails if we would like to. And also very importantly, we can manage any duplicates to make sure that we don't import any leads that are already in this campaign. So we don't keep prospecting the same leads over and over again. And we can choose to not import leads that are in any Lemnist campaign at all. So that means that if they are being prospected by someone else, that means you will not prospect them yourself. So it means that you're not spamming people, essentially. This is what's important about managing duplicates. Let's click confirm for now. And just like that, there you go. It's pulled 129 leads straight into a Lemlist campaign, ready to do whatever you please. Of course, what we're going to do is we're going to build our sequence, etc. We can maybe even enrich and verify these emails. If we've got some emails and we want to verify them, that's exactly what you can do here with this feature. You just press it. And then in a few minutes, you will have all of those leads verified with deliverable email addresses if they are ones that you need to check. Now, a couple of pro tips as well that I'll touch on. Here, if we go up to settings and then we click on CRM integration, we can actually choose the stage in HubSpot when a deal is created in Lemlist. What does that mean? Well, we can select a particular stage so that automatically when a deal is created within Lemlist, it is pushed into your CRM so you don't have to move things around all the time. Let's use an example. If someone replies to me and they want to book a meeting, what I can do is I can make sure that they automatically go into discovery call pending and then I will automatically have that in my dashboard in HubSpot so I don't have to manually put it there or worry about where it's going. So if I were to choose that, then what I can do is also make sure the deal is created in HubSpot. So to create a deal every time that a lead is marked as interested. Also, what I can do is I can make sure that a deal is created when a task is created within Lemlist. So how do you create tasks? Well, you do it like this. Create a new task when people reply by email or LinkedIn or whether they click on a link. If a task is created here, so if someone replies to me via email in one of these campaigns, I'm prospecting someone, a task will be created. And because I have this other setting toggled on here, a deal will also be created within HubSpot. So you have the freedom to do what you like, essentially lots of different ways of doing it. You don't have to do it. You can do it. Try it out. You can always change it afterwards as well. There's that freedom to do whatever you like. Final option, of course, adding activity from Lemlist into HubSpot. Pretty important. You want to make sure you understand what's going on when you're prospecting and that it's in your CRM, your single source of truth. And what it looks like is this. I can go into the support article here. This is what it looks like here. So any notes that you have will be transferred directly over. Any opens, any email replies, any communication between the two, all of it synced into HubSpot as well. So you don't have to worry about it. Now, one final thing to make sure that the campaign name and lead state are synced over to HubSpot. You need to come up to your settings again. So click the little profile uh, pick here. Then you come down to integrations and then you make sure that this button here, connected integrations, is clicked on. That way everything will be synchronized over automatically. Now I'm going to finish very quickly here with a real world example. Let's find that campaign again. There you go, HubSpot import. If I create a sequence, super easy. Let's create one manually. Email. Here's a super quick example, a really easy one. Let's say you have people signing up for a free trial and you have those people within a lead list in HubSpot. It's very pretty simple to set up. So you can say free trial is a subject line, you're sending them an email and you
you want to send this email as quickly as possible as soon as they sign up for a free trial of Lemnist. There you go. So you sign up for a free trial of Lemnist, fancy quick demo. Obviously, you don't write it like this, but it's just an example. Make sure I've connected up an email and then the campaign is ready to review and launch. And what you can do, one of the reasons why this is so important and so valuable is you can make sure that every single lead which arrives in that campaign in HubSpot, that lead list in HubSpot, is synchronized directly and automatically straight into Lemlist. And then it can be reviewed automatically because what you want to do with things like free trials in this example is you want to reach out within the first five minutes. Otherwise, the conversion rate plummets. I think it goes down something like 80%. So what you can do is you could come over here, you could select a condition and make sure that every deliverable email is auto reviewed and review all leads and enable auto review. So as soon as a lead has a deliverable email within Lemlist's internal system of enrichment, as soon as someone arrives in the HubSpot lead list, they go directly in here, they have their email verified, and then they are sent the email campaign. So that's how you can do that. That's something that we've done ourselves. Obviously, it doesn't look quite like this, but this is just to show you an example. There you go. That's how to automatically synchronize Lemlist to the leads in your CRM and also synchronize the activity back to your single source of truth. If you want to read up on it anymore yourself or go over one or two things that I've mentioned, you can either reach out to me or you can check out this article here that the support team have very nicely put together for you. Check out the other videos on this channel and comment below any questions you have. You want to try it out for free? Try and connect Lemlist with HubSpot yourself. Click the link in the description.